All right, we're back. I'm just going to pop this on. I had it set up on the wrong game, actually. That's never been done before. Apparently, I have to change it every time. So now I know. All right. All right, so... We just did a big uh, magic related spell and we discovered that there's a magic book over here that shows you the different things you can do like air strike water strike um different things that you can come up with this is for the camera okay so there's all sorts of different stuff i can do wizard's tower All right, let's see if we can find some quests to accomplish. Looking good. Talk to Ariani. I can't believe Cedrigil would set up a ward to keep me out. I didn't realize he'd seen me as that dangerous. Mm -hmm. What was that thing in the library? That's what I wanted to find out. I know the tower is in danger, but I don't know the details. How did you know the tower was in danger? I have premonitions sometimes, flashes of information, emotional impressions, nothing precise. Lately, I've been having visions of the tower in flames. Oh boy. But I don't know any details, so I can't prove anything. I came here to investigate, and now I find I can't get into the building. Huh. Sounds like you don't like these premonitions. Or other questions. Anyone can learn it if they put in the effort. But being a seer runs in families. It's not something I worked for. When I told the other wizards about it, they resented me. I tried to use my magic to understand and control my ability. My goal was to integrate it into magical theory so I could teach it to other wizards. But I ended up being expelled from the tower. Why aren't you allowed into the tower? There are schools of magic besides the tower's standard spell book. I used a forbidden source of information when I was trying to understand my premonition. What do you want me to do? I need you to go into the tower for me. Talk to the wizards and find out what's happening in there. Archmage Cedrigil is the head of the tower, so you should talk to him. I think Wizard Eleron might help as well. He was my mentor while I was there. You should talk to the other wizards as well. Ask if they've seen anything unusual lately. One of them must have seen something that will help us. I'll get on it. All right, let's look at, whoops. All right, let's look at the map. If I can figure out how to do that. Alright, world map.
you are in the wizard's tower, so they only just turn around and go back there. I was thinking they were saying go to the mage training area. I know I'm not allowed in there. Alright, I will go back in there then. Got the same sword I do. Alright. Ascend beam. Greetings, human. Greetings, human. Seen anything unusual lately? Everything about this place is unusual from my point of view. You're referring to that thing that attacked the librarian, however, I've never seen anything like it before. There's an old human called Kyborg in this tower. He's always talking about strange creatures. Maybe you should be asking him. Old human called Treyborn in this tower who's looking talking about strange creatures. Maybe you should be asking him. Thank you for saving me from that thing. Please keep my mind spiked as a reward. What was it that attacked you? It was horrible. It felt like it radiated evil power. And you saw what color it was? Red. The color of a Samurai. It was Red Wizard who burned down the tower a hundred years ago. This could be another Samurakian plot to destroy us. We've got to do it. I must be outside. Greetings, human. Greetings, human. Be patient like water. What? Tower. Welcome to the Wizard's Tower Adventurer. See anything unusual lately? Just the usual stream, usual stream of visitors. Adventurers, students, traders, no one unusual. Why do you... Oh. I was told by Brother Samwell you might be able to help us. Oh yes, my dear friend Samwell. It's been years since I saw well, you. Well, how is he anyway? Not so great, actually. A group of monks he was traveling with were attacked. He's okay. We're still trying to find the culprit. Gosh, he isn't hurt, is he? I'll help. 
him any way I can. I'm afraid I can't leave my post, though. He's a little shaken, but he'll be fine. I just need some information so I can track down the killer. Some of the victims were killed by similar stab wounds. Here, it would be easier if you had a look at my notes. You show Wizard Valina the notes you've made. in some of these fields. I'll help in any way I can. Ask about the elves, ask about the wizard, Sir Dumwig, ask about teleportation, ask about trapped souls. I'll first start with asking about the elves. an elf to venture so far from Tyrannon, but it's not unheard of. I am particularly intrigued by the crystals you found. Being an expert on crystal magics, I have conducted much research on the subject. Firstly, crystals are extremely precious to the elves. For them to be discarded so carelessly is highly irregular. And that's ignoring the assumption that a skilled assassin would leave any clues at all. Secondly, a crystal arrow would be entirely crystalline. I have yet to come across one that is crystal tipped as you've described. In summary, the clues you found are quite misleading, so I would advise caution, adventurer. You learned one out of three things from Wizard Valina. Ask about the Saradominist wizard. Some of these clues do appear to indicate the involvement of a Saradominist, potentially a wizard. As you can see, my position allows me to keep track of the comings and goings of many wizards. Anyone entering or leaving must check in with me. No one from this tower has left for a significant amount of time. But admittedly, I cannot account for all Saradominus wizards across Gillinor. Regardless, this kind of behavior is uncharacteristic for a follower of Saradomi. It seems an unlikely conclusion. Okay, I trust your judgment. It doesn't sound very convincing. It sounds you're hiding something. What on earth are you insinuating? I am an esteemed wizard of Saradomin. I hold honesty and integrity in the utmost regard. Now, if you must scrutinize my counter-argument, I will offer a more scientific hypothesis. Firstly, the weapon of choice. The elf was killed by an accurate stab wound. Wizards are trained in magic, not combat. Secondly, we all wear the same standard of robes. You describe the blue fabric at the crime scene as rough linen. Whereas our robes are woven from wool and imbued with defensive enchantments which give the fabric a distinctive shine. If anything, it sounds like the killer was trying to impersonate a wizard. You've learned two out of three, two out of three things from Wizard Valina. Ask about teleportation. Ah, oh, yes. This doesn't sound like regular teleportation. Normally the spell would emit light rather than absorb it. A possible explanation is that the killer opened a rift 
quest to escape to a darker realm or dimension. But that would require powerful magic which most wizards have yet to master. It doesn't seem to conform to the other evidence. It all depends how reliable you believe this blaze sharp eye to be, really. You learned everything you need from Wizard Bellini. Ask about trapped souls. This may surprise you, adventurer, but we have been receiving reports of similar happenings recently. I must say, I have never encountered anything like this before. An ethereal spirit trapped in the physical world. How intriguing. Here at the tower, we research all manner of magic. I'm not aware of something like this ever being documented until now. I would say this is not a magical phenomenon and certainly not related to your killer. What we're dealing with here is on a much larger scale. It would seem something quite drastic is happening. All right. That explains that. They still have me looking around in this room as in they've marked it out with a light blue color. I wonder if there's something else I was supposed to do here. Let's see what else they're able to do. Send beam. Does that mean go up or something? It does. I went upstairs. There's more people up here. Hey. Not now. I'm trying to concentrate on a very difficult spell. Is that your demon? Have you seen anything unusual lately? Only wizard Mizgog's beads turning up all over the floor. I shall send my imps to hide them before someone trips over them. Why don't you go and bother with a tray board instead? That old duffer is always singing with me. Is that your demon? I summon it, do you mean? Certainly not. Although, I am the only wizard in this tower with the expertise to guard and study it. How did it get here, then? It's been here longer than anyone remembers. 
I dare say some foolish wizard summed it while meddling with forces they did not fully understand. Every time it's destroyed, it reappears on the same spot. So we built a containment wall around it and left it there. Oh, sorry. Whoa. I see what I was asking about. Thanks. Small, small mortal. No, you are not as interesting as she was. I will not speak to you. You're not as interesting as she was. I will you not speak to you. Stop that! Speaking to the demon is strictly forbidden! There was something else to click on, but it was. Oh, it was probably on the inside of the wall. Grayzog, Mizzog. Yeah, that's on the other side of the wall. Let's go over there. Let's see who else there is to talk to. Jara Jalarst. Can I help you? What's that you're wearing? You seem to be unusual. Lady. I heard that commotion in the library earlier. I assumed it was Wizard Boran jumping at shadows again. I'm not sure he's cut out for the uh, stressful life of an academic librarian. Okay. Can I help you? What's that you're wearing? This is split bark armor. It's special armor for mages. It's much more resistant to physical attacks than robe. It's actually very easy for me to make, but I've been having trouble getting hold of the pieces. What do you need? I need bark from a hollow tree and some fine cloth. Unfortunately, both of these can only be found in Mauritania, and the cloth is only found in the Tomb of Shades. Of course, I'd happily sell you some armor if you bring me those items. Yeah. Well, good luck with that. Take logs. Man, taking up three spots. Salmon torch. Shards of crystal that the wizards have enchanted to glow. Salmon torch. Shards of crystal the wizards have enchanted to glow. Oh, two torches, same description. I think that was it. Oh, I can search this cupboard. Here's Mizgog. I haven't talked to him. I think he's the old guy the other guy told me to uh, talk to. Uh, my, my, my beads! Where are my beads? Seen anything unusual lately? I, I think wizard... 
Grayzag's imps have been moving my notes around. I, I, I can't find the section I, I was working on yesterday. Why don't you ask Wizard Drayborn? He, he the loves telling people about things he's seen. Another person tell me to go to Drayborn. Can I help you with your beats? My, my, my beads. A wizard gray sag next door de decided he didn't like me for some reason, so he, 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 he enlisted an army of imps. The imps stole all sorts of things. Most of them are uh, things I don't really care about, like uh, um, eggs, balls of wool, uh, uh, things like that. Uh, but they stole my magic beads. There was a red one, a, 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 a yellow one, a, a, a black one, and a, a, a white one. The imps will have spread them all over the kingdom by now. Could you get my beads back for me? Must be able to defeat one level five imp. Wizard Mizgog opens his mouth to elaborate, then glances nervously at the door and quickly closes it again. Wizard Ms. Gog quietly scrolls a note and discreetly hands it to you. He presses his forefinger against his lips, then taps the side of his nose. The paper would show up in here, but it isn't in here for some reason. I think I've already gone to him. Yep. Next, I gotta try this guy. Talk to Wizard Isidore. Oh, hello there. Can I do anything for you? What do you do? Oh, have you seen anything unusual lately? I'm sure there's been something strange happening with the power beam lately. The beam acts as an anchor for all our teleportation spells. So, as a teleportation specialist, I'm sensitive to any fluctuations. Archmage Sedridor is aware of the problem. Perhaps you should ask him what he's doing about it. Oh, hello there. Can I do anything for Apparently you? no one can tell me. They just have to send me somewhere else. Seeing I'm a pattern. wizard, obviously. I work on portals and teleportation. Teleportation? Did you teleport me anywhere? I could, if I had a precise means of fixing the destination. A teleport phrase, for example. 
Right now, I'm working on something else, sir. You read a book title at random, How to Become the Ultimate Wizard of the Universe. Okay. You read a book title at random, 101 Ways to Impress Your Mates with Magic. Yeah. Most interesting room so far. We've got different spells here, different people here, none of which I can talk to. Examine door. Let's go this way. This one's missing a spell. Can I put a spell here? Nobody to talk to over here. Check in the cupboards. Nothing there. Back there, if I come out here. Whoa, what's going on? Right. Interesting. That's like a flying sundial. Examine arcane device. No doubt serves some important purpose, but only the wizards know what. Just growing out of that one. Let's check these cupboards. That's it. That's it. Nothing. Nothing. Alrighty. Stand in B. Probably send me back down. Oh, ascend, descend, top floor, bottom floor. Oh, let's go up. It's an elevator, I see. There's Elrond. Well, we'll go to Elrond first. Where'd he go? A hovering chair? He was right there. Did he sit down or is it something? All the chairs are hovering. Whoa. Check this book. Book at random. Living with a wizard husband. A housewife's story. Somebody sleeping over there. Somebody sleeping over there. Check this bookshelf. Book at random A Life and Times of the Thing Gummy What by Trayborn the Wizard. Look at random living with a wizard husband, wizard husband, housewife story. Apparently, they have two of them. All right, so not there. 
There he is. Eleron's back. What can I do for you on this glorious day, adventurer? Experience is the towers indeed. Are her premonitions still troubling her? I fear this much. Please let her know that I take her seriously, even if no one else does. I will do everything I can to convince Archmage Cedridor to take action. Hey, hey, ex Dakota or Dakota. You know about her premonitions? When I took Ariane on as my apprentice, she asked me to help her suppress her premonitions. She didn't want to stand out because of a natural gift. She wanted to stand out, if at all, by the work she put in. I told her that that was admirable, but it would be wrong to turn down an advantage the gods had given her. I helped her to harness her gift, to refine it, and to Zamorak with what the other wizards thought. With hindsight, it shouldn't have surprised me when Cedridor expelled her just for using every source of knowledge at her disposal. Arian might be pleased to hear the wizard Elrond is still on her side. What can I do for you on this glorious I'll day? I'll tell her when I get outside. Who are you? I am the wizard Elrond, Grand Master of the Order of Saradonia. Initiate into the inner circle of the Rune Mysteries, heir to the sacred tradition of the Staff of Fire. Impressive, no? <laughs> we wizards love to invent titles for ourselves. All it really means is that I'm one of the senior wizards of the Tower. Goodbye. Nope. Ooh, there's a crack open safe. This feature can oh. Okay. Nothing suspicious in here. You can search this cupboard, but I don't think there's any way to get it open. Ooh, take leather boots. You could do that. If there's any room, need more space in your inventory. Okay, well, I will craft logs into a incense sticks. Now do I have room? I do. Oh, they're level five. They're tiny wussy shoes. I probably don't really need them. You never know. Somebody might say, hey, where are my shoes? I'll look for them. Oh, look, I found them. 
Ooh, a chest. Rune chest. Not saying anything. Is that because I don't have space? Read message for Mizgok. I don't think I actually read his message. Red, Sanguine, Air, Southwest Faroque. Yellow, Cleric, Fire, Northeast Alcarid. Al Black, Melancholic, Earth, Northeast Faroque. White, Phlegmatic, Water, Southwest Lumbridge. Seek out my beads of the four elemental at the four elemental altars. They are the source of their power. Do not be deceived by the fake beads carried by the imps. Interesting. Okay, so that's that quest. Let me see. Can I... I'm going to drop these logs just to have more space in case that's the reason we can open it. Open it in two more options. What are my other options? Examine the chest. Contains Archmage personal supply of rune essence. It's weird they won't let me open it. I wonder if I need a key. It does show a little symbol, a blue symbol on it. That might be what I need. Examine telescope. Archmage must need to make many astronomical observations. Hey, here's the Archmage Cedridor that we've been looking for. Everybody sent me to him. Welcome, adventurer. To the world-renowned Wizard's Tower. How can I help you? Can you teleport me to the Rune Essence? Can you tell me about Wizard's Tower? Arian says Tower is in danger. I'll start with that. Yes, I'm aware of that. Wizard Valina told me she was here. You can tell Ariane that her concerns have been noted. I'm preparing to deal with the anomalies in the power beam, so there's no cause for concern. Anomalies in the power beam? Don't you believe her? Why won't you let her into the tower? What are you going to do? What are you going to do? I'm preparing an Icenic purge. It'll send a surge of energy through the power beam which should overpower whatever creatures have managed to enter it. Why won't you let her into the tower? You know what she did, don't you? She said she used a forbidden source of information. Wizard Ariane was our most promising student. She could have been Archmage someday. I overlooked her gallivanting off as an adventurer. Everyone's reckless in their youth. But I can't allow a demon worshipper in the tower. The tower has had strict rules against Zamarakian wizards for the last hundred years, and I have to apply that even to her. Don't you believe her? I can see that there is some evidence that she has premonitions, but unless she can give me more specific information, there's really nothing I can do. Other questions? Teleport me to Rune, Essence, tell me about the tower. Nothing thinks I'm just joking around. 
Hmm. Tell me about the wizard's tower. The tower is the finest institute of magical learning in Mistalin, Ascania, or Candalin. The standard adventurous spell book and the teleportation lodestones are both products of tower wizard's research. Most importantly, the tower guards the secret of the rune essence, which allowed human civilization to prevail over the monsters and barbarians and ushered in the fifth age of the world. Can you teach me magic? What are the ruins I saw outside the tower? The secret of the rune essence? How about can you teach me magic? You already know the adventurous spell book. For an adventurer like you, the best way to learn is to go out and practice casting spells. Secret of the rune essence? Yes. Specifically, the secret of the teleportation spell that lets us reach it. The discovery of the rune essence and the ability to make rune stones was the single greatest magical discovery in the history of Gilinor. It allowed anyone to produce magical effects easily and reliably. The rune essence lies in the frozen north, where the Eye of Saradomin once rested. The first wizards reached it by an arduous land route, but eventually they discovered a spell to teleport there directly. After Zavarakian mages burnt the tower down a hundred years ago, Archmage Perian decided to keep the spell secret rather than let it fall into We will cast the spell for anyone we think trustworthy. But the spell itself is an inner mystery of the tower and is taught only to select individuals. What are the ruins I saw outside the tower? Ah, they are the relic of a sad chapter in the tower's history. Originally, the wizards of the tower were not as unified as they now are. There were orders devoted to different gods, notably Saradomin, god of goodness and order, and Zamarak, god of evil and chaos. The orders worked together for 70 years, but eventually the Zamarakian wizards betrayed the others and burned the tower down. Archmage Perian rebuilt the tower and forbade Zamarakian wizards from joining. The rebuilt tower has been united and at peace for a hundred years. Goodbye. Yeah, tell her about the plan. Now we have two things to talk to her about. It's also got a little blue one on it, but I can't click on that one, so that's interesting. Examine bunk bed? No, that must be in the next room over. Let's examine the room. Aha! Uh -huh. Bunk bed. Okay. Read a book title at random, hundred way, one ways to impress your mate with magic. Hmm. Can't examine it anymore. That's interesting. Talk to Wizard Trayborn. Hmm. A safe I probably can't open anyway. Book 
case it's probably just a database they randomly choose a title all right wizard trayborn the other one everyone keeps telling me to talk to hello young singular one see anything unusual lately i've seen them in the power beam you know the singular ones he looks familiar Singular ones. He looks like the bad guy. What? No, not singly ones. Don't be ridiculous. They wouldn't fit. It was a sort of swirly, sparkly thing. It was in the power room. So many things to see every day, but never look at after. Or look at every day, but never see. I see things in there. Think of me once. No one else sees them. <laughs> they think I'm mad. Where did they come from? was built on the ruins of an old tower. That's where it came from, the swirly thing. I saw it come up through the floor of the library. Marion might be interested in that too, so that's three things. I bet that's it, but let's keep looking just in case. I don't even think there's any rooms I can go in. Life and Times of a Thingamawet by Trayborn the Wizard, his book. Thingamawet. I think this is the room I started with. Examine rune chart. Hmm. Diagrams of advanced runes. Oh, it did say something. Search book is. Okay, so I've been here. Let's go in the beam. Let's see if there's anything upstairs. Otherwise, I'll go all the way back down into the area. I clicked ascend, so I must be. I'm to the top of the wizard's tower. Congratulations. Enter mid level rune span portal. Oh my gosh. Rune crafting guild portal. Low level rune. Man, this is like the teleportation area. Wizard Phoenix. I hope they let me into the runecrafting guild soon. It's cold up here on the roof. Deposit box. Hey, I need one of those. What do you do? What do you sell? Can I see your shop? Anything unusual lately? I heard that a strange magical force had entered the tower and attacked the librarian. But that's all I know. Here on the roof, I'm a little cut off from what's happening in the tower, and I still haven't been allowed inside the Rune Crafting Guild. Oof. I hope they let me into the Rune Crafting Guild soon. Be yourself. You can buy wicked robes from me. The hood will give you runes and rune essence, and even teleport you to the rune crafting altars. The rest of the robes will improve the hood and make you lighter. Ah, oh. somebody else came here. I can also be a good place to go. And provide you with an esteem icon for them to 
to show off how much you've trained energy cycling. Yeah. Okay. I can also provide you with staves made of rune essence. These are ineffective as melee weapons, but they can store the charge for spells which only cost runes and are good at defending against magical attacks. Dusty, I can sell you a rune essence pouch that is much bigger than any you would find elsewhere. This pouch will not degrade as quickly as other pouches, but once it has degraded, it will turn to dust. I see your shop. Maybe I could sell some of this extra stuff with these leather shoes I just got. Wow. My points zero. Three color cost two thousand points. Can I sell stuff? Doesn't look. Oh, you have to pay and you have, you have to pay and you have to have rune crafting. Level. Oh, the wicked hood I can get. Menacing magical hood. Conjures runes and essence. Hmm. Interesting. Deposit box. Is that for my bank? I think so. Deposit one broomstick. Leather boots. Rope skirt. Ashes. Heat. Rats tail. Blade looks way better than this blade. I think this is like a special one for a quest. I don't really need any more. Task list. Give me a little more space. That's a good thing to have. I could probably put it here in case you want to buy stuff from him. Low level rune spam portal. Ooh, let's try that and see where it goes. Hello, how can I help you? Oh, same guy. I talked to him to get back. What can I do here? 